If you're trained in STEM, you're able to look at a problem, to pick it apart and think logically. For the future prospects of students who study STEM, it's not necessarily to train them to be a scientist or an engineer or a mathematician, it's also to empower them to be freelance problem solvers. So we're interested not in students memorizing a list of facts, but rather learning how to think and how to use this skill to solve problems in the most general sense, no matter what their career prospects are. So an important part of having impact in chemistry, a field where we have a unique position of making new and useful materials, is to bring them into the marketplace and into the real world so they're used and actually make a, a large impact on, on humanity. And in my teaching program and in my research lab where I educate and train students, many of the, the processes and materials that we make, these are, are adopted by industry, these are the materials of, of the future, and in this way students can see not only how chemistry is a central science and important to the future of humanity, but also how we can use that to drive the economy and create new industries that are yet to exist.